Warzone dropped a new limited time mode called Sleigh Ride Resurgence. Now, this is their version of a Christmas map, and I'm going to be breaking it down and explaining to you guys everything that you need to know. First thing that you're going to notice is that they changed the color temperature of the map, making it a little bit more blue. Now, I'm assuming that they did this to make it look a little bit more like a Christmas map without putting all the snow on the map and going through all that effort, but it kind of just looks like a Sheikah Island. Um, so I think that is pretty much an L for me. Now, upon pulling up the map, you're going to notice that there are snowflakes and Christmas trees. Now, the snowflakes are going to be snowball refills, which are essentially a version of a concussion grenade and a throwing star. You probably throw around two or three to end up getting a kill, and every single one kind of freezes them a little bit, which is extremely fun. And you could do some really cool combos with this. Like, if you were to throw a snowball, which stuns them, and then shoot them a few times and throw another snowball at them, it will completely down them and full them, and it is extremely, extremely overpowered so make sure you guys try that out one of the things that you guys are going to need to know is that upon spawning in you're going to sp start with nothing but five snowballs so once you land in and if you decide to land at the christmas tree which i did it's going to be just a cluster fest of everybody going for the crates kind of like it's hunger games and going for the guns otherwise what you're going to have to do is throw these snowballs at them now after capping the christmas tree which is pretty much like a, a control point if you have played multiple multiplayer you have to cap it to tier the end of tier two going to the beginning of tier three and a black site key will drop giving you a door that teleports you straight to the black site now this is actually really freaking cool and i loved this i thought it was an amazing experience now another thing that is really cool before we get into the black site is that if you're being pushed out by the gas it's actually just a white out snowstorm which is super super cool that damages you over time obviously just like the gas does but i thought that was just a really cool tidbit before we go into the black site now one Whenever you get into the black side, beware because the entire lobby drops here. It is actually insane, especially if you are not the first one to be done. It's just going to be absolutely insane because it's literally resurgent. So everybody's going to be spawning back in after you kill them, just coming back down to try to cap the black side. Now inside the black side, there's a dead Santa Claus and a ton of zombies that spawn in whenever you shoot at him. Now, I actually figured out a way. Somehow there was a car that spawned inside of the black side and I just hopped into the car and drove over the Santa Claus but you're gonna have to put a lot of bullets into him if you can't end up doing that glitch um it's really cool because he ends up dropping some flares advanced uavs munition boxes and a ton of stuff for you and your team now there are a few other really cool things um and before we get into that make sure you guys subscribe if you guys are enjoying this content it really helps me out pumping out more videos for you guys now there are reindeers that you can hunt down these things actually take a lot of bullets and if you don't either have a good gun that like kind of can shoot long range or maybe a vehicle to kind of chase it down it can be a little bit difficult um the first time i tried um chasing this reindeer down i actually wasn't able to kill him but what they do is they drop flares and gas masks and, st and stuff like that so that's really cool um because it's a way to get your teammates back and also just to get extra loot if one of them is near you now this is a really cool portion. There is a train um, that spawns in, I believe, on the third zone or the end of the third zone. And it's super, super cool because there is a Santa Claus also on there that also has a minigun. So if you gun down the Santa Claus, which it took me, honestly, because I did this solo a long time to do, um, you can even see his little red health bar, which is really cool. But once I got him killed, it also drops a minigun and a ton of loot, just like the Black Sight does. Um, just no advanced UAV and you can pick up that minigun and gun people down and honestly like i got a few kills with the minigun and i thought it was really cool at first until they started to kind of eat bullets and it kind of was a little underwhelming now there are some rewards that are done by doing challenges and you can get this ugly christmas grandma sweater if you end up doing all of them which is pretty freaking cool now i think that the map was actually really fun and i'm curious to see what you guys think so let me know down below the only thing that i'm a little bit disappointed in is that the color kind of looks like a chic island but other than that I've had a great freaking time playing it. Let me know what you guys think, and I'll catch you guys later.